Alright guys, welcome back for more Rage 2, Mutant Bash TV is exactly where we left off in the last episode, completing half of the mission for Lusum Agar, and we're gonna have to complete the last half of the mission actually, which is all about races today. It's gonna be a lot more casual than, than the Mutant Bash TV actually. Uh, I don't know if it's gonna be like series or just one race thing, chase car derby, here we are. I hope you appreciate the transition. Spares you all the driving in the empty lands actually. Um, I wonder also if we're going to compete with the Phoenix. This is gonna be all so interesting to check so we can have access in the end to Clegg Clayton's winner's lounge. Which we're not allowed to do to go now, I'm sorry guys, because we're losers. That's the way it is. Alright, we got there in one piece. That's a good thing. Lusum, I'm at the racetrack. Chaz Car Derby it is. Keep your eyes on the screen. I'm gonna win this. Good luck, Walker. With those psychos you'll be racing. You're gonna need it. Alright, looks like we found God Chaz. Damn. God damn! Look what the ball tall rolled in. You here to bet your ass in the race for Chaz? Tell me it's so old Nicky Rain. Tell me you sent this wasteland butte to race like a stick of butter on a pile of pancakes. After you, hot sauce. Alright. Racing, baby. I can see you got the grit to be great. You got the meat it takes to take the plate. And you got all the trimmings, too. Got a contract right here, Prime Cut. <laughs> you sign that? Well, you sign it blood. <laughs> oh, you race your way to the top crust like a knife through sirloin, and you emerge victorious and take the gravy, too. <laughs> when do I start? Scritch scratch, we got your John H and we good to go. <laughs> oh. Yeah, well, you start at the bottom, fresh meat. Get the pity bucket. You prove your sizzle in that slow-mo ride. And then move on up. Simmer to the very top like the slickest grease in a gumbo. <laughs> go grab your ride when ready, huh? Right, we're right in the action guys, we're starting last, that's not good, I don't know if I'm gonna win this race, I'm gonna do my best, we didn't get to select like the difficulty and uh, right away you can see like, whoa, we're competing against people with names, so I wonder if it's still AI or, uh, cutting corners here, that's dirty but it works. I don't know if it's like um, AI players or online players actually, but we're going for Gumball Deuce. You can bet we do. Wow, the racing is actually quite fun. That's one cool part of this game. I wonder if there's a championship or anything. I'm trying to cut corners here and we got the pole. We are here. Now I'm gonna try to... Uh... Ah, watch out! Ooh, there's a handbrake, thank god. I'm gonna try to keep the pole until the end, push it again and again, there's a sort of a nitro, electric nitro actually, it's just a, a lamp, if you can see it, it's like three lamps at the bottom rear, with little flames coming out of it. Alright, I hope I'm not gonna get flagged as well for the music going on, it's quite heavy if you ask me, I'm trying to talk over it as well. Not like I'm not talking usually over anything, right? Anyway, we seem to be pretty much in front and ahead. 120. That's our first lap. There's two laps. Uh, there's a guy completely in front. I don't know what it is. I think it's the last one. I wonder if we can compete and try to get back to him. It's the little pink dot in the bar in the upper left corner. Everybody else is pretty much behind. There's a bit uh, of a distance. Sometimes the car feels like it's it's like engraved inside the road and sometimes it's just flying around. It's very weird, very weird feelings. Wow, holding the controllers. It says that we're second on eight. Ah, uh, I don't understand where the first one has gone. I mean, 
aren't we first? Didn't we beat everyone? I actually don't know what's going on here. Or is it like the second race on hate? No, we're disputing our first race. I'm really confused here, guys. Maybe you have an explanation, but I don't. Maybe it's a bug as well. Um, really, we're dominating this race as much as we can. Uh, and just when I say that, I make a mistake, of course. I'm taking the exterior way, which is not the right way. Oh, man. Yeah, it shows that we're second on eight. I don't know what I did to be so far away from the first. I'm trying to push it as much as I can now. Trying to compete. Man, that's quite of a good racing game. It's good looking. The race is simple. Oh, I'm trying to cut corners. We're losing a bit of speed when we get in the rough as well. And we're second, wow! I don't know, I honestly don't know how the first one got so far away from us. That's incredible. Alright, we're gonna try again. Man, I don't know how the first one just got far away just the way it did. Let's go, two, one. Let's go! Oh, we're fifth, seventh. This time I'm gonna try to push it even more. We were unexplainably second to the last race. This lady is cutting. Maybe that's why I'm taking too many exteriors. That's not right way to start the race. I'm gonna push and push again. Oh wow, what am I doing? Alright, now it's gonna be a real challenge, guys. Look at this. It's going to be a remontada, like they say in Spain. Seven on eight. We gotta give it all. I'm gonna give it all. Cutting all the corners I can. Let's go. Oh, I'm right behind the six. They're all packing up. That's a good thing. Look at that. We're getting positions. Whoa, we destroyed one even. And now we're first. And it's all about keeping the pole. I don't know guys if I'm gonna be able to do it because last time we tried the, the second one, well now the second one who was the first one, was really, really ahead. Oh, we hit the wall, that's not good, he could be right behind us, that's frightening. I'm trying to talk and pilot at the same time, this is completely insane. If you look at the, the pink dots in the bar in the upper left corner, you can see that they're right behind us and I'm really pushing it, right? Whoa! Let's go, guys! Will I keep the pole until the end? That's one lap. Going for the second. What a suspense! I'm seeing a tiny bit of black in between us and, and the pink dots. Oh, still taking the outside. Should have taken the inside. I always forget. It's more like I'm trying to stay on the, on the track and keep my advantage. Let's go! Alright, still first. Almost there. Last, third. Past the checkpoint. Faster! Oh man! We're taking a bit of a lead, I think, over the people behind us. Which is a good thing because I'm dead afraid of not finishing this race first. Alright, almost there, almost home. I really can't give more than that guys, I'm telling you, I'm pushing all the way. This car is not really giving much more than what it can. That's super funny. Ah, the wall, the wall. Oh my god, driving over the wall. There must have been an accident behind because the pink dots are not really moving and we're still going forward. That's good news for us, if you ask me. That's what it takes also to win. A little bit of luck, always, in video games. Let's go. Little rain breaking. E break, baby. Uh, too much. Oh my god, we're right there. They're gonna come back. No, we should do it. Woo, guys, we win. I really don't know how we did that, but we did it this time. Sticker Chew is fourth. And we got 10 auto parts. Oh man. We did the best we could, and it paid off. With 30 seconds over the second one. And we unlocked the chess car, so really. We managed to unlock a car by winning this race, that's great. It's unlocked in the vehicle's menu. Now 
Lusum? I've got it. Free pass to the winner's lounge. I saw it all on the vid screen. Guess you really are the shit. I was some grade A sportsmanship. What can I say? That's how I roll. I'm on my way there now. Gotta go. All right, I'm gonna bring back that uh, that vehicle to the trade town to Wellspring. Actually, I'm gonna spare you the the driving as well, making a swift transition through the map, and uh, we're gonna be able to have it stored. I want to see if it actually works in the systems. So I'll see you there in a second. And there we are, bringing back one more car to Wellspring, and we're gonna see if the system stores it actually. We can also enter the winner's lounge and uh, we're gonna meet Clay Clayton very soon. Alright, Kodakon Conquest and 5 auto parts. So you always uh, get auto parts when you store cars. If you're in need of auto parts, you know what to do. You bring back home as many cars as you can and you go with that and it's gonna give you auto parts for it. Um, that's the lounge, here we go. I'm here to see Clegg Clayton. Welcome inside, winner. Alright, we made it. Ride the elevator. Enter the winner's lounge. Still don't know which way to go. Oh, this way, okay. The mysterious openings of elevators. Oh man, what is he doing on the ground? Get up, man. <laughs> oh, this game, I swear, sometimes. Oh wow, dancing people. There's someone even sleeping on the floor. Dance too much. Hey buddy, you fine? And this is Clay Clayton. Hey. Hey, listen up already. I got a great, nay, tremendous surprise for you all. Looky over there, dames and dudes. Here he is. The infamous wasteland tycoon Clegg Clayton. So ego-centered, he's been known to torture people just to get their approval. <laughs> I, the great Clegg Clayton, give you the one, the only, Killer Dilla Walker! Our latest ass-kicking champion! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, my latest golden goose, you stick with me, and the sky's the limit. You want to make it big? You want to be a star? Well, old Uncle Cleggy Clayton's got your ticket to the top! I won't let you down. What's that? I want to make it big. There's no goddamn doubt. Everybody's got a purpose on this rock, and yours just happens to be being the goddamn best! <laughs> So, uh, what do you say we go somewhere a little more secluded? I may be about to offer you the dealio of a lifetime. <laughs> so we're gonna access his, uh, his private lounge, I guess, where we're gonna put the tracker. Need no introduction. And that should do it. Everybody knows the story of irresistible Clay Clayton, the orphan multi-billionaire extraordinaire. That's why you're here, of course. I know. Everybody wants to see the digs of the wealthiest and most generous man of the land. Ah, here we are. Gotta love the fan on the shoulder. Behold, Killadilla Walker! This is the innermost core of this high-powered city. This is the multi-watt nerve center of the Clegg Empire. My office, the cockpit from which I control my vast financial holdings. I am the richest man in town today, but soon power absolute will be mine. Tremendous power. As soon as that old Decrepit crone lose some Hagar surrenders her mayoral office to me. Uh, things here will take a turn or two for the better. I'll just you wait. So, being rich not enough for you? 
You're cut out for something bigger, right? Now, let me tell you about my father. My father... My father was a great man. He... Everyone tells me he was a great man, but he built the base of Wellspring. He did, but my father... My father, he lacked the vision to merge power and economics. He was a mayor, but he didn't have any real money, see? I... I do not lack vision, people tell me, and I tell people that I will become the most powerful man in the wasteland. What? What could possibly be so imminent? Oh, right, right. Hold on a sec. Oh, Killer Dilla Walker, baby. I gotta take this. Please, make yourself at home. Pour some swill. Have a sewn shot eyeball. They're extra gloppy. Right. Right, plan the gizmo on Clegg's number. Computer on Clegg's number. Uh, we got a data pad here that we're gonna collect. I'll let you read it. I'm gonna take the cash. Thank you. $30. He's a billionaire for Christ's sake. Oh wow, but he's gonna see it. He's gonna see the, the tracker right away when, uh, when he comes back in and uh, that's never gonna work, right? Not the data pad look at that it's it's huge in the computer there's no way he's not gonna see this we'll never make it to the lobby oh man I can't believe we made it to the elevator actually I wonder how many goons we're gonna have to fight in the lobby right that's gonna be oh man I can't wait I'm tensed let's go Decrepit old Lucem these days. Oh, here we go, guys. Oh, surprised? Yes, I just got wind. Nothing escapes Clay Clayton. Yeah, it's true. My spies and agents are working 27 27 to keep me informed. I guess Clegg got the best of you. I guess you're just a loser after all. And as these are surely your final moments, I shall let you in on my big reveal. Yeah, I got it all thunk out, you see. You see, I've got the most powerful player in the wasteland in my corner! Who? The authority, that's who. I'm on a first-name basis with General Cross. So when they take over, oh boy, oh boy, the sky's the limit! And all thanks to my extremely accomplished negotiation skills. Now, I guess I'm just the best at everything I do, and you're just a stupid little loosome puppet. Well then, goodbye, loosome puppet. Goodbye! All right, guys, here we go. Ooh, what was that? He opened the trap in the elevator, and now we're trapped, literally, in his basement. We gotta find a way out. There's a crate here. Oh my god, what is that? Holy moly. No, 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 no. Oh, look at that, Jumbo. Kill Jumbo. Are you kidding me? Wow, he's pretty fierce. Oh my god, he looks like a giant version of Clay Clayton. That's absolutely ridiculous. It's like his twin brother, but from Alabama, you know? Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Oh my god, now he's pissed off. Oh, I'm trying to hit him as hard as I can with the rifle. Headshot. Wow, we're gonna need a healing here. Oh, I keep running around. Let's go. Take this and burn. He keeps burning even after I snap my fingers, which is good. Now it's all in his face. He's almost done for. And I went for it as... Yeah, just as he did. And we won this fight. We both went for the slam and mine was more powerful. Barely. You okay? Yeah, I'm right under Wellspring. Got dumped through the elevator shaft into some kill pit. But the real news is, Clegg is in bed with General Cross. And we can't dally. I'm sending in a strike team for Clegg. He's gonna talk one way or the other. Over and out. Alright guys, now we gotta find the... A way out of here, and I'm, I'm not afraid to say that Clegg working for the for the authority was really a twist that I was waiting for from the beginning. What are you doing, buddy? You okay? You fine? I'm not gonna shoot you. My aim is green when I look at you, so I'm not gonna shoot you, I guess. 
He must have been so scared. Maybe here to feed the beast. It's incredible how it was looking just like Clay Clayton. It's, it's hilarious. Uh, we got a date pad. Read you, I let you read that. Sorry, guys. Uh, and we got a valve to turn. Ooh, we have people right behind that door. I know it. We heard it. Let's go. There was someone behind the crate. Yeah, there was. I heard it right. So, I guess there's gonna be goons all the way until we get out of here. That's gonna be a good moment for splashing skills. Whoa, I thought that was goon. It was just a model. Alright. I'm a bit scared that they're gonna jump from everywhere. Uh, there's a door, there's a crate here. Oh, there's a container, but uh, we can't access it. That's a shame. Alright, let's turn that valve. Find a way back into Wellspring. We're on our way. Reloading. Facing the wall, always. That pad, feeding Jumbo. It doesn't give us much uh, experience, if you ask me, but... 10. We can't take that, that's not supplies. Ooh, we have people in over there. We just got one, we're going for the second. No, he's down as well. That's good, collecting felt right. Alright, they're gonna come for us now. What are you doing laying down, buddy? Stand up and fight. Oh wow, they're coming out. Thank god we have the Firestorm gun. It is so helpful, look at that. We even have an overdrive if we need it. We are 100% health right now, so we don't really do need it. Uh, which way? Not this one. What was it? Uh, an electric panel? Okay, we could have used that. Take care of the goons, actually. Uh, we can take that. I feel that it's the way back, yeah. We should keep going around. Where are they? No, this way. Left. Oh wow! I found a tank. Predator. Authority. That's the ticket. The Project Dagger Predator tank. If we get that up and running, we'll be good to go. Imagine it was under our feet this whole time. We had a three for one. Pretty much cleaning the room. Two more here. And now we're gonna have a tank. Imagine that. I don't know if it's gonna be usable like right away when we get to the top or uh, if we're gonna have it for the final mission for the project dagger but it's essential and I'm happy we're gonna have a tank look at that looks like the Batmobile or something from Arkham Knight it's quite a nice reference as well if it is if it's not it's copy paste <laughs> come on that's quite hilarious as well um all right we made it to the I think that's ground floor hello oh my god she jumped wow Okay. Oop, should be four. Detonate after. That works better. Let's go. Wow. Coupled with the vortex, it's quite cool. Uh, this grenade coming up. She actually throwed it at her feet. Let's go, let's finish this. Gotta clean the floor. It's a lot of felt right, focusing for it. Oh lordy! Find a way back to Wellspring. That's still the same objective. Um, we heard him saying like, that's my ride, but I don't really know what he was talking about or where it was. I'm gonna have to find out. Oh, there's a data pad here. Not to forget, giving the game away. And looks like I found the way. Guys, I've been running around killing goons. And at some point it was quite empty. That's because they're all trenching here by the elevator. Look at that. I'm trying to clean it with all the, all the grenades. That's hilarious. They're packing up. A little bit of vortex. Wow, we have grenades coming at us. We gotta move. Hello, guys. You going down? I love that snapping fingers thing. Thanos effect. Let's go. Crowd control. Reloading. Ooh, and shatter. The strike team is in the tower, standing by. 
Okay, we're almost there. I'm cleaning just around and uh, we're gonna take the elevator up. That's not the elevator, I think it's on the ground. Uh, right under. One more buddy here. Let's go. Wow, look at that. All these people hanged. We're gonna make it one level down and it's actually right here. Hello. Ooh, and we have two big ones here. You gotta be careful. I'm gonna play grenade. Yeah, I took care of it. Alright, let's push that button again. Let's go. Wow, guys, can't believe we made it. That was quite a ride, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I'm checking the inventory. Oh man, I'm, I'm, I'm just catching my breath again. My team is in the tower, standing by. Shouldn't be long now. Hook me up to their channel, so I know what's going on. Yeah, hold on. Go, go, go! Regroup, formation! Breach! Clayton, drop the weapon! Holy moly, he was riding an Icarus. Damn it! I should have done this job myself. Where's he headed? Likely to hide under his master's skirts. Well, at least we found the predator. Dagger's looking real good. Head over to my office. I'm gonna talk. Hey! Alright. I just I just have to find the way again. Guys, that's the city all there we go. Man, what a mission. I'm happy we completed it. That was a two episodes mission that was quite long. But we completed it beautifully. Return to lose some. And that's gonna conclude our adventure for today. I still have no idea which side of the elevator it's gonna open. That's that's always hilarious to me. It's like the red barrels that don't explode in every game or explode in every game. Let's see what you got. So I drove that scumbag out of town. Now we can focus on Project Dagger. Yeah, for now. But he's gonna stick his ugly dome up again if we don't deal with him permanently. There's gotta be something of value on the data you pulled from Clegg's computer. I'm on it. Decrypting the data as we speak. We got a team down in Cleggy's creepy dungeon retrieving the Predator tank and the other tech as well. Great. Let me know when you have the Predator up and running. Will do. Now, with Clegg out of the way and the tank secured, we could benefit from your help on some projects around here. And I have a feeling that you could too. Alright, we unlocked the project for Lucem. So now we have all three characters' projects unlocked. Actually, I'll let you read that as well. It's a lot of icons. And uh, as I'm going to put some points in this menu, I really wish you have a good time on the channel, that you had a good time watching, enjoying this video. If you did, Drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. I see you in the next one. Take it easy.